Well, hello there, and welcome to How to Doodle Man with me, the Doodle Man. Today, we will be doodling a king. When doodling a king, the first things you'll need are a piece of paper, a pencil, and of course, a pen. But just use the pencil for now. Start by drawing a large oval in the centre of the paper. You may be thinking, goodness, this is a large oval, but you'll see why it's so big soon. Move your pencil to halfway down the oval and draw a line directly from one side to the other. Then move up to the top of the oval and draw a slanted sausage to sit on the top sideways. Now three mountains on top of that slanted sausage. Three pearly circles are then placed on these mountains and soon you see a crown appear. Add a drooping sausage shape down the centre of the top half of the oval. Draw two slanted lines down on either side of this drooping sausage. One large mouth shape goes under the nose. Now, a mouth could be any shape, but this one is kind of like a sideways pancake landing down. There you go! Ready for the pen? Use the pen to outline the top half of the oval only. We're going to leave the bottom half, it was just there to help us. Now run your pen around the edge of that mouth. Down the nose also, making sure to leave a gap at the bottom to show the connection to the forehead. Put two dots near the bottom of those lines, either side of the face. Draw around the rim of the crown, and then move the pen on to outlining the mountains. Then, yep, you guessed it, the circles at the top. One, two, three, and four dots on the rim of the crown. Three little dashes for the spikes. Now we can run a line across the mouth from left to right. A squashed M letter shape at the bottom of the mouth to create the tongue. Fill that mouth with black ink as the final touch. And there he is, the king. <laughs> Remember, creativity is very important when doodling, so I would urge you to experiment with your king doodle. There's so much fun to have! You can exaggerate the features we have created. Here are some kings I drew earlier. A diamond face king. An extra large smile king. A big nosed king. An extra long nosed king. A big bean bag face king. And a king whose crown is simply too big for him. Oh dearie me. <laughs> so many ways to do it! I've even taken the time to add my king into an even bigger doodle. By creating more and more characters and things, you can create a whole bunch of stuff to stand next to the king. Thanks for watching. Have a doodly day.